Ah, Phelps. I was just discussing with Finbar here how well you were doing. Have a seat. Yeah, my real name. And you can just forget all about it. You boys have a new case. A poor Hispanic woman murdered near City Hall and left lying naked in an alleyway. Another naked woman, sir? Yes. We seem to have had quite a run of them since the Dahlia Fiend first struck. Phelps is politely trying to hint that he thinks the Mendes case is hoping. Well, young Phelps, you win some and you lose some in police work. You're happy with the Mueller case, sir? Over the moon, boys! The DA couldn't be more pleased with the evidence, the witness, and the lack of an alibi. Now, get out there and catch me over the So before we begin this case, let's uh, take a break here. All right, everybody, welcome back to the Silk Stocking Murder Case in Ellie Noir, which Ellie has undoubtedly committed. <laughs> no, I don't. No, Silk Stockings isn't my forte. Oh well, you like to drag it out longer? Yes. How do you drag it out longer than killing somebody with a silk stocking? Tied into the back of the car and just doesn't <laughs> normal routine with silk stockings. With silk stockings, yes. Jesus Christ, Elliot. I put, I like put the silk stocking over their heads so that they won't see where they're going. They'll still see. It. Silk is that silk stockings aren't really hard to see through. I know. And Elliot shows us the sights without any context. Okay. <laughs> um, what are we doing? Refresh memory. We're going to the crime scene. What's the crime so far? Is another? It's another murder. Another or on the homicide desk, their murder. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was saying, <laughs> another, homicide desk. Someone must like, have been overdosed. Is this still like a black dahlia kind of? Yeah, case. that's what they're speculating, but we're not too sure about that yet. I'm really, I'm positive Phelps is the Black Dahlia killer. Cole, come on! Yeah, Cole, come on! <laughs> Three room apartments. Detectives, they're ready to start the show. I'll take you through. Yeah, more editing for you, John. Oh, I don't have to edit feet. Now I gotta add it. Oh, for <laughs> sake. Brothers, Pinker. Cause of death is pretty apparent. We thought we'd best wait for you when you're ready. <laughs> you saw that? <laughs> okay, Jim Carrey. <laughs> Antonia. Only 21 years old. Wow. But why the library card? Did he want us to find it? Poor woman. All right, so what is she was trying with this time? Kiss the blood. Kiss the blood. B D. Lovely. The flies around her head already. She must have been dead for a couple of hours. Last you saw the blood spurt out a little bit. Would indicate a great deal of force. Jesus. This is definitely one of the most brutal ones. It's homicide. I wouldn't expect anything less. In terms of detail. Another missing ring. Another ring. Huh. Another wedding ring torn from the finger. Oh. Skin under the fingernails. Jesus. Man. The evidence in the Mueller case was solid. I'm not convinced about Mendez. Best way to get away with murder is to pin it on somebody else. I'll bet a month's salary this is a copy cat. Strangle, batter, Yeah, naked. yeah, yeah. We know the M.O. So does every jerk who kills his wife and girlfriend looking for a way out. I've spoken to Brown. He still believes the Dahlia perp has medical experience. Four women. All murdered, all put on display, all with messages. Mueller had no message. Look, Phelps, this is getting us nowhere. Anything for us to go on now? Head injuries from contact with road, bruising from a small man's shoe, further blunt force trauma to the occipital region at the base of the skull. Could have been fatal, but clear signs of strangulation would seem to rule it out. And a vagina that absorbs Lipstick light. Lipstick appears to be a similar color <laughs> to the other cases. I'll see if I can nail down a brand. I like my vaginas with teeth. What? Right, that's the second time you said that. What are you referencing? He, he, vagina dentata. Uh, well, you know, it's a black head like the others. She was probably unconscious when strangled. Somebody beat her in the head with a silk stocking enough to make her bleed. She wanted her dead. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. That's A. That's B. It has to be more to go on. There is. I'm turning the camera. 
The trail of blood, huh? Hey, there's a trash can. May as well follow the trail. <laughs> <laughs> Call this on the phones. Antonia. Antonia. Oh, same as the library card. She's a fashion designer? Doesn't seem like it. Mm. You heard that ding? That was the hat. Let's see what else there is. Hang on, champ. What's in that alleyway? What? This alleyway? Nothing. Oh, uh, okay. No Matt, thank you for wasting our time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still like one, it's one. The score on that is still one to eleven hundred, Elliot. <laughs> Where's the blood trail? There it is. It's on the ground over there. Big Mac and fries. <laughs> what is this? A Red Bull and a no, no, I'm kidding. It must have been from her. Hmm. It's like hygiene products or something. Yeah. She's been using Brand X. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's move on with this trail. It has to be more. It's just like she was battered all over the place. There's a shoe! Hmm. Proximity to the scene, plus the blood stains. No way is this coincidence. Yeah, she was beaten by a shoe. <laughs> the shoe was thrown, ricocheted off the wall, hit her in the head. Who could pull something like that? I heard a ding. Revolver right. ice a lot. <gasps> Son of a bitch! No, it can't be he's serving in the Cold War. No, it's 30 years from now. <laughs> He'll find a way. He always <laughs> finds a way. <laughs> it's always oh, awesome. Let's check it out. What's that? Wait, what's this that? This looks like the alleyway that we were in the beginning of the game. Looks familiar, but it's not. Way bigger. And so anything shyly for us? Up like bait on a hook. Hmm. Interesting. You think he's trying to lead us somewhere? Probably all the way to City Hall. Then. How did you hear me from here? <laughs> <laughs> Murderer. <laughs> Can you imagine if the guy's still there? It's got Two, five, and three. Like dot patterns. They look like dice patterns. That's why I was saying they look like dice. Yeah. The ladder. Huh. Jesus. Where are you? Pretty sure there's gonna be blood on the ceilings, and now we gotta. <laughs> Did it again! into our inner anti gravity. Can you imagine if Phelps having to hit a coin block and blood splatters out of it? <laughs> <laughs> Going up. You'd swear it's like the way the blood appears everywhere in this case, you'd swear to goodness you'd take psychokinesis at this point. <laughs> Did you, you, where's the blood coming from? Was it from the woman? Did yeah, it has to be. her all the way. He dragged Beyond her all the over the goddamn place. This seems intentional, like he's leaving clues all over the damn place. A Maldonado. Empty. Empty? Where is all of this meant to be taking us? This guy, whoever's doing this, is actually pretty smart with us. It's a hidden camera show. <laughs> oh, you got me, guys. <laughs> <laughs> but this guy, he's he's like pretty smart with us. I wouldn't say smart. He's, smart. he's, he's just, just say depraved. He's a, yeah, I wouldn't say smart. He's just fucking with us, though. He's depraved. What is this? That would be a makeup kit, Ali. Gold and gold plated. She was precious to her. Christ, this woman got money. Yeah, I mean, fuck. Probably what she was doing. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Even up here? <sighs> Jesus. Trail points. The trail leads to the roller coaster. Oh, uh, damn it, really? <laughs> <laughs> I saw something tinkle. Tingle. Twinkle. Tinkle. <laughs> Either stop pissing. Huh. Sorry. Damn, that worked. What's the significance? Huh. It's a wild fucking goose chase. That's what I'm thinking. You go over there, all the way right back to the crime scene. I mean that in literal sense. There is actually a goose. <laughs> that could be the blood. <laughs> I wouldn't say blood. It's blood. It's as though the killer was decorating with this. 
Okay, so he didn't drag her everywhere. That must have been a strong motherfucker if he did. <laughs> her purse. Handbag. Purse. Handbag. You see, this is like a, a bomb. <laughs> this is like a, a guy with the bomb finish. You probably rigged the purse to blow up. This is Antonio <laughs> Maldonado, 712 North Hill Street, downtown. Hmm. Well, we gotta go to her place now. This is something, I mean. Wow. Wow, that's like one of the longest clue hunts you ever did. Thankfully, thankfully Phelps has gained the ability to teleport after you're done. Huh. What is this? Yeah. Holy shit! This is John Marson's hat from Red Dead Redemption. I heard that... Ah, oh, this game... I heard, I heard about this souvenir store. A very overrated time in our history. <laughs> what, the Westerns? Yeah. Overrated in what sense? Overused? I still think World War II is pretty much the most overused <laughs> setting in a video game history. Some World War II just happened recently. It's not been overused yet. Don't you dare talk about it. <laughs> so uh, our culprit is John. Yeah. Elliot just fought a truck and lost. <laughs> so I don't think our culprit is a cowboy. We have to travel back in time in order to arrest him. <laughs> Anybody got a DeLorean? <laughs> oh, Matt. That's in less than 40 years. I'm sure. Phelps doesn't have 40 years. Like, what was the average life expectancy around this time? 50 years old? Oh, no. Whoa. Uh... No, uh, oh, never mind. Hot dog stand! Oh, he does not want the lower class Damn! to go. She went, he rocked her and she ended up holding her knee. Ooh, white pants! <laughs> it's after Labor Day! Elliot, the- I thought you were trying the court! <laughs> she was mad rollerblades. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you monster. Anyway. This house looks nice. A boarding house? Yeah. Rooms, 35 cents. Fifteen For beds, 15 cents. Oh, man. How I wish. Yeah, right? Yeah, if fucking only. <laughs> I think they're a little late. Like, <laughs> huh. I'm sorry. Can I help you? LAPD, ma'am. Detective Phelps and Galloway. Does Mrs. Maldonado live here? Yes, she does. I'm Mrs. Barbara LaPente, the owner of this boarding house. Is there a problem? I'm afraid so, ma'am. Do you mind if we come in? Is there somewhere we can discuss this? Of course. Follow me through to the parlor. Wipe your feet as you come in, detectives. It's this way. Mrs. Maldonado was found dead this morning. Dead? Oh no! She can't be. I'm afraid she was murdered, ma'am. We need to take a look at her things. I can't believe it. A person seems so alive, and then they're gone. Antonia's room is upstairs, last door on the left. Thank you. We'll be back shortly. I can't tell if it's just bad acting or. <laughs> I think it's a little bad acting, to be honest. <laughs> Still more emotion than Knuckles from Sonic Adventure 2. <laughs> oh, seriously, that dude has all the emotional chops of a butter stick. It just sits there. <laughs> oh, good thing the door was unlocked or we need that key. Ooh, what the? A smashed window explains why the place looks tossed. Huh. She never believed in doors. <laughs> <laughs> Always felt the need to tackle her way out through the window. Well, it's her fault for keep because she liked to go fishing with her key. <laughs> she used her ring as bait. You say? You know that looks like something you would see on a fence. <laughs> it does actually. She's a believer. She probably went to church. Ah, privacy of mail. <laughs> She's dead. That's a good point. Right under my correspondence. Blah, 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 blah. Attorney letter. Summary. Basically, it seems to be a restraining order against Angel Christopher Maldonado. Basically, she's trying to get away from the abusive spouse. Oh, uh, I see. Yeah, it's usually one of those cases. And she probably ended up fucking him at least once during a week. Oops. A religious charm bracelet. Charm Seems to be an interracial thing. Is he black? Evidence. No. Really? It doesn't look like it. 
I would think. I thought it was at first. I'm sorry. I mean, maybe it's just the way the photo. Maybe it's just the way the photo looked. It looked very. It looked like an interracial marriage. <laughs> well, in a black and white photo, you're either black or white. <laughs> 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 no, I was expecting like a certain degree of pigment. <laughs> if you're black, you're clearly white. You, did you see the guy? He looked like he absorbed light. Sorry. <laughs> Oh, well, let's talk to her. You have some questions, ma'am, if you're up to it. Yes, detective. I'll do my best. Do you have any idea who might have wanted to hurt Mrs. Maldonado? That rat of her husband, Angel. That's true. She was yeah. serving him divorce papers. If I killed every wife to serve me papers, I'd be a mass murderer. Are you being flippant, young man? No, ma'am. Young. What can you tell us about Angel Maldonado? She married him when she was 17. He was cruel to her, very cruel. She was a good girl, little on the religious side, but a good girl. She reminds me of that old woman from um, the Goonies. <laughs> the the one with the the, one with the, the cronies. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what time did Antonia go out yesterday? She left around nine. Do you know where she went? No. I, I have no idea. She was a good girl, but she didn't confide in me. The moves of the victim. Well, Downer. Let's check, let's check the log just to make sure. Yeah, what time did she leave? She left around nine. No, she went where she went. Yeah, just doubt her. Because it's well, a, because it's obvious that she's not telling the truth, but we don't know shit from Ding Ningo. It's doubt. A nosy old hag like you knows everything about the people who live under her roof. Where did she go? I think she went to a bar. She's been drinking quite a lot lately. This bar have a name? El Dorado Bar. It's a Latino place on North Los Angeles Street. That's only a couple of blocks from where we found the body. <laughs> You've had a break-in? No. That can't be true. Uh, that's oh, so shit! <laughs> You're being economical with the truth, Mrs. Lepenti. What do you have to hide? I have no idea what you are talking about. The broken window. Yeah. No shit. So Antonia lost her keys and used an iron bar to jimmy the back window? <laughs> like I said, she doesn't believe I you. I heard a noise lose. in the early hours of the morning. I thought it might be a raccoon at the milk bottles. It'd be very bad for business if this news got out. I have a reputation to protect. Antonia and her husband were estranged? Yes. She moved here after she separated from her husband two months ago. But Antonia still wore a wedding ring? She wore the wedding ring and a necklace. She always wore a religious necklace. Why? It wasn't a religious necklace. It was, so a, that's religious, a, it was a religious a charm bracelet. Right. What about her bracelet? I don't know anything about a bracelet. The picture that clearly shows it. Here's the thing: that would not be something you would catch on the first time In around because photo, she's displaying a charm bracelet. Honestly, you may not. Know, she may not know I that think? about her. She never wore it. He gave it to her. She always kept it in that wooden jewelry box. Wooden <laughs> jewelry Thanks, box. You've been very helpful. Pay a call to that husband of hers. Lock him up and throw away the key. Thanks, Grandma. We can either front <laughs> Angel, seeing as the finger's pointing right at him, or we can check out the El Dorado bar. So what do you guys want to do? Nah, fuck you guys. We're going to El Dorado. I don't know. Throw away the key. Think she meant it? <laughs> <laughs> El Dorado bar. bar. <laughs>